to the center of your mat and find a nice cross-legged seat. Enjoying this day and this moment to be here on your mat. Reach the arms overhead, bringing the palms to touch, finding a nice stretch and sweeping the arms back down to your mat. Lift the gaze up towards the sky, tilt the head down, come back to center and tilt the head from one ear to the other. Roll the head through the center and get that nice stretch in the neck. Then extend the right leg out and fold in a stretch over that right leg. Walking the hands towards the toes. Just enjoying that stretch. Working your way back up, we'll extend the left leg out, tucking that right foot in and taking that forward fold. Maybe you reach your hands down to grab the toes or an ankle. Maybe you're just reaching that direction. Rising back up, we'll extend the right leg out to a wide-legged forward fold. Walking the hands down, maybe reaching the hands towards the feet. And rising back up, we'll shift around, planting the feet and lowering down one vertebrae at a time. Windshield wiper your knees from one side to the other. Maybe pausing in a long fold on each side. Just enjoying that stretch that works into the lower back. And then tucking the knees in towards the chest. Giving yourself that gentle embrace. Maybe finding a little bit of a rock side to side. Enjoying that massage on the lower back. We'll extend the arms out to a T and drop the knees over to the right side of the body. Inhaling, exhaling. Knees will come back through center and over to the left side. Bringing the legs back into the chest. We'll keep the left knee hugged in and we'll extend the right leg down and away. Maybe you explore finding that twist again bringing the left knee over the body, allowing it to rest on the right side. Spreading the arms out to a T if that feels comfortable for you. Finding that deep inhale and exhale, we'll bring that left leg back in and switching the legs out, right knee hugged in, left leg extending away. Maybe opening the arms out to a T. If you'd like to, taking that right knee over the body, allowing it to fall to the floor. Bringing the right leg back to center and bringing the left leg in to meet it. We'll find that nice happy baby. Bringing the knees in towards the forearms, maybe grasping your big toe or the outside of your feet and eventually hugging the knees back into the chest. We'll begin to find wide circles with the knees, rotating both knees together down and around to the right, over to the left and back through center. Taking this wide circle once or twice, and then eventually moving the other direction, taking both knees over to the left first, then to the right. After a few circles, we'll move the knees in opposite directions. Option to keep the hands on the knees or legs here for a little extra support, but really just stirring that hip joint. A few circles one direction, a few circles the other, and then we'll extend the feet up towards the sky, finding a quick waterfall, and drop the feet down and together, finding a reclined cobbler's pose. And just enjoying alternating on this stretch, extending the feet back up towards the sky. Bringing the knees back to your chest, slowly rising up to a seat and finding a few more stretches, this time taking the neck from one side to the other, dropping that right ear towards the right shoulder and reaching the left arm over. Maybe your right forearm comes down to the ground. And then we'll take that to the other side left forearm to the ground as the right arm reaches over and coming to a nice tall seat back at center we'll roll the shoulder blades first one direction 
and then the other. And finally bringing the palms to rest on the knees. Finding a moment of stillness here. Finding your deep inhales and exhales. Appreciating this time that you've taken to give your body some extra refilling energy and give it a final stretch. Thanks so much for joining me.